Hello my dear students, this is your guide and mentor for organic chemistry, Mrs. Mehmuna Bongabala. My dear students, in this video, we are going to talk about the resonating forms for pyridine. And whenever we do, we talk, we do any discussion about pyridine, we never forget talking about pyrrol because pyrrol becomes a base to understand pyridine and to understand the difference between the two is the most important. Remember, when we talked about the resonating forms for pyrrol, I gave you one trick. Let it be for pyrrol, let it be for furin, let it be for thiophene. I gave you this trick that always resonate this pair of electrons. As we said in the structure that the lone pair of electron is lying inside the ring. We said, please do watch my video on the resonating forms for pyrrol. You know, we said that pair of electron will move to give you a double bond, double bond will move to give you a negative charge, then that negative charge will move to give you a double bond, double bond will move to give you a negative charge, and these are the things that we talked about in pyrrol. Remember in pyridine, my dear students, never, never, never touch this electrons that are lying outside the ring because they are not participating in resonance and that is the trick that you should remember. In pyrrol, pair of electrons go home. In pyridine, do not touch them. Everything else will be alright. Now see, how do I write the resonating forms for pyridine? See for example, a double bond is moving towards this nitrogen and depositing a negative charge here and at the tail of this double bond, I am getting a positive charge. This is a double bond or another double bond, as it is. Right? I am telling you, do not touch this pair of electron because whatever is whirling are the pi electrons which are inside the ring of PD. Now see, have a look at this double bond is moving to nullify the positive charge and at the tail of this double bond, there is a positive charge here, right? And this is as it is, this is as it is and this is as it is. Again we say double bond moves to nullify the positive charge and at the tail of this double bond a positive charge. Here this is as it is, this is as it is and this is as it is. So that is how it stops. Here it stops. See the, the important thing that we should remember is in pyrrol lone pair of electrons go wrong or in pyridine do not touch them. Just let it, let it be there outside the ring and whatever is moving is the the, the pair of electrons that are inside the ring. This concept that the pair of electrons are lying outside the ring will explain you all the reactivities. In my next video, we will be talking about the basicity, the basicity of uh, pyridine. Of course, this, this, these two videos will only explain you the basicity and the reactivity towards electrophilic aromatic substitution and also something new that is that we are going to see in pyridine that is nucleophilic aromatic substitution. Keep watching, don't forget to subscribe this channel. Thank you.